been the best college semester I've had. Being in Amman, it's presented me with new challenges and adapting to a new culture and meeting new people. But I feel like it does give you like a really good picture of what the Middle East is like because there's so many different people here. One thing that was important to me in coming to study abroad was getting connected with other communities that share my identities. And so for me, my faith identity as a Christian was really important and I made it a priority to get connected with the church here. I think my favorite one was actually a tour of the art district here in Amman called um, Web Day. And we went around and just checked out a lot of um, cool cafes in the area as well as art. Um, and then we all had like dinner afterwards at a really cool restaurant. Um, we were able to talk to a journalist um, who works for the LA Times and he's their Middle East correspondent based out of Beirut. But um, I don't know many other people who when they're abroad get to talk to people like that. My home stay is really awesome. You get a lot of language experience out of it. That's how you really learn Arabic, is by living with a family. A few other students and I play basketball every Wednesday. So then we get to interact with other locals, um, get to use that language that we're learning. One of those things for me personally was when I received a photography grant from CIEE. The networking that you can do here, especially if you're studying like Middle East politics or like you want to do something in the region, it's such a great opportunity to network. We have Arabic every day and the nature of the classes is so intensive that you learn a lot. My supervisor, is, he speaks both English and Arabic, so we can communicate effectively, um, but it's still a good way for me to practice. It really helps develop more of a sophisticated worldview, and I think also um, it just provides an awesome opportunity to get really uncomfortable. I don't think it's possible for anyone to go study abroad and have everything 100%, be smooth sailing and be comfortable, because you're in another context that's so different from your own. Um, I think for that reason, it's automatically going to lead to a lot of personal growth. And so I'm really thankful for the opportunity to study abroad because of how much it shaped me as a person and helped discover more of who I am learning how to communicate when my communication skills are limited, uh, and sort of trying to break that cultural barrier, which is an experience I haven't had yet. But for the first time, I'm actually thinking about how can I fuse my um, digital storytelling passion with my passion for politics, and especially in the Middle East. And so now it's like kind of coming together with like how that all is gonna look for future endeavors and what's next for me. And so there's just like things that kind of happened for me here at CIEE that only could have happened through this program or through this experience.